This is a PSOC Creator tutorial for adding API template files. We previously created the component symbol and an implementation. Here we'll add API template files to provide instance-specific APIs when the component is used in a design. In the Workspace Explorer under the Components tab, right-click on the component and select Add Component Item. On the dialog, scroll down to the API section and select the API header file. Enter a file name. Since you can have multiple header and C files for your component, each must have a unique name. Click Create New. PSOC Creator adds the file to the component in a subdirectory named API. It is also opened in the code editor. To provide instance-specific APIs, use the instance name parameter expression. Type backtick, dollar sign, instance underscore name, and backtick, and then complete the prototype. This expression will be expanded to the actual instance name when the design is built. When complete, save the project, then switch to the design. We've already placed an instance of the component and renamed it to widget. Click Build to generate the API files. When finished, click the Source tab in the Workspace Explorer. Under Generated Source, there is a folder named Widget that contains the instance-specific API file. Double-click the file to see that the API contains the actual instance name. Notice also that the generated file name contains the API template file name. To remove this, use the symbol property API Prefix. Select the symbol file, right-click on the canvas and select Properties. In the API Prefix field, Type the part of the name to be removed from all generated API files and click OK. Click Build again. When finished, notice the file name now only contains the instance name. There is much more information about API templates and creating components in general in the Component Author Guide.